right, y'all. Walking up here in Hobby Town in Beaufort, Georgia. If you guys haven't been here, put a link down below in the description. Just trying to see what they got going on here. So in here, just kind of checking out and seeing what they got. All right, so we're just checking this out up here. We got the stars of the show right over here. Over here, this is management, security, security, management. You guys figure out which one's which. So you guys. Only see he's not security right now, but he will be in a minute. So they got a couple of things they're working on over here. Uh, you guys know they got plenty of stock. Everything up there. That truck. Everybody wants that truck, but that truck is like five thousand dollars if y'all want to get it. So cash only too. And then you guys know they have the mini track up here too. They race uh, periodically. I think they got a race. They got a small race coming later this month, but they have a bigger race coming up later. You guys check that out. He's over there giving some practice on, ran into somebody. So, got some more security right there on. He's on his thing. What you doing over there, security? Oh, I'm just messing with my car right now. <laughs> He's messing with his stuff. Uh, okay. Tires and wheels, bodies, planes, everything else. And some of the stock is down there. They got some low C bikes up in here. I'll check this out. So I have never seen one of these up close. That actually looks pretty good. Look at that. that actually looks real good. So they have the Raptor R and then also the boat with this trailer for it. So they got it here for $11.79. So if you guys wanna come up here and check this out, that actually is a lot bigger than what I thought it was. And that actually looked pretty good. You put this together right there. Hopefully I can step back far enough to show this. There we go. And then of course they got some Raptors down here. They got a couple of these boats over here. This is the BLS2 slash, um, BL2S slash I should say. So they got one of these up here running. Got a couple of armor cars. They got some Gorgons in stock. So you guys that are looking for them, they actually got them. Two Titans, Sentin, down here, seeing what else they got. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is what I was looking for. See, I know I'm a uh, Stampede 4x4 fiend. So, yeah, I know this is probably going to happen. <laughs> That's more than likely going to happen with this. So, let's see what colors they got. Uh, they got a blue one here, and then they have a green one. So this is the body I actually wanted, this orange, uh, orange, white, and blue one. But we'll settle for a blue one because I really want to get this out. We know that this is kind of like a modified hoss, actually. The hoss with uh, basically a stampede sticker on it. And you guys know, you see here, I did an RC update on this. It's got the heavy duty parts on it, which actually makes it good. It's got the 540 XL motor and the 3S speed controller now. You can take the speed controller out and then put a 4S speed controller and run it on 4S and it actually run like a max 4S. So um, I'm probably gonna pull the trigger on this because you guys know I'm a fiend for a Stampede 4x4. And I may do it and I may, uh, I may do it and do a quick unboxing here. And they are running, look. I'm probably gonna pull the trigger on that one. I need to go ahead and if I'm gonna do it, I'll take it up front, but here they go racing. So next time they have one of their races, I'll definitely come up here um, and film it. He's going that little white car over there. I don't want to get y'all too dizzy. I stand right here so y'all can see it. <laughs> but yeah, next time they do a race, I'll let you guys know. Follow them on Instagram because they do post that stuff on Instagram too. And I'll try to keep up to date putting stuff in... Um, my community page and posting a video when I can about it. So eventually I'm gonna get into doing this too periodically because this track actually looks pretty detailed and fun right there. And here's paint and stuff as always. Uh, Stafford, don't come up here and buy all that paint. My boy Stafford be buying everybody's white paint. You can't never find none. <laughs> he don't know about the hidden secret up here. So you guys know they got models and stuff like that, but um, I'm going to go over here and I'm gonna pick this bad boy up make sure I get the the one I want the blue one yep the blue one so we're gonna actually pull the trigger on this um 
I may unbox it in here real quick. Uh, yeah, I may just do that. I may just uh, go ahead and purchase this and take it open. And we may actually take it outside and run it. So let me go ahead and make a move on this and go ahead and get this. And then um, we'll just do a quick unboxing. And we may take it outside and just give it a quick run. So, All right, y'all. We are going to go ahead and unbox this. And we'll probably take it outside real quick to get it running. So he's going to help me out while I film. He's going to cut the cardboard. <laughs> Take it out. We got to get that new RC car smell going on. So you guys know it comes with, of course, the TQI radio. We'll put this to the side. We don't care about that right there. Standard radio comes with their 3S brushless models and 4S. And even some of the 6 and 8S models. So, All right. You guys know standard stuff right here. Uh, spacers for the shocks. You guys know I'll probably be getting GTR shocks for this at some point in time. Um, tools, all that stuff in here. Instruction manual, you got extra stickers, blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. So we're going to take a look at this. He's more interested than me. <laughs> take that body off. And there you guys see that that's the body for it. This is the blue one. Like I said, it's, it's a hoss. They just modified it, put these heavy duty parts on it, but I'm glad they actually did this because they should have this a long time ago. Maybe called this the Stampede 2.0 XL or something like that. But there's going to be a look at it. Um, it does have the upgraded shock caps on there. You guys see that with it. But I'll be replacing these at some point in time. It's got the 540 VXL uh, XL long motor in it. So I, you can run Forest on here. But, 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 but you need to change the speed controller out. You guys have the heat seat or fan for this? Possibly. Okay, so if they got that, I'll probably go ahead and get that. And of course, it's got this fan on the speed controller too. And you guys know it has all the heavy duty parts on it, which is going to be good. I don't have to worry about breaking drive shafts. The wheelie bar is not adjustable for it, but it doesn't matter. And then, of course, it's got this modified body tray. The previous Stampede, you can't put a longer battery in it because it's actually shorter and stuff than this. So, any comments, questions, anything I might have missed, y'all? <laughs> No, we're doing this quick because we're actually going to get this out. And it's got these um, tires. So these are actually, in my opinion, some of the best tires you can get on a 10 scale monster truck. Because they don't really balloon too much. And they actually got a hard enough compound to where they last long. But it's soft enough to still get grip and stuff on. So we're probably going to take this outside and take this for a quick rip. Because we want to see it run. <laughs> Alright, y'all. So I'm going to go ahead and put a battery in here. We're going to take this out and get this running real quick. And y'all, just I told y'all, multiple jobs. He's the key security today. Hey, hey, hey. No filming in here. No, hey, so I'm, I'm going to put a little disclaimer down there. <laughs> All right, y'all. Let's get this out. Let's take this for a run. All right, y'all. We're going to demo this. Don't flip my car, man. We got a 3S in there, of course. He's going to give this a quick rip up and down. We just want to see it run before I... Some tires gotta break in. I guess it does come to speed gear too, right? Yeah, I think it comes with a speed gear. So we'll get this out and test it today, y'all. Stock out the box. See how this runs, but it actually, it runs smooth. I mean, you guys know Traxxas cars run smooth with it. He's loving that bump. I'm, I'm getting nervous over here. He's gonna take one more down time down, and then we're gonna switch uh, drivers real quick. All right, let's switch it up real quick. All right, we got the more inexperienced driver myself in here. We'll let this car go on by real quick. Look, he wants to race. I think I'll beat him in this parking lot. Definitely need to um, stiffen that suspension up, I think. 
That's still about 40 something out the box, I think. It's a lot of traffic over here, y'all, so I'm not even gonna risk it. That suspension in the front definitely needs to be adjusted, but anyway, I wanted to come up here and show y'all Hobby Town. This guy wanted to be the star of the show over here real quick. So I'm gonna actually get this ready. I'm gonna do a super speed Saturday test, stock out the box, just on 3S, I'm not gonna worry about 2S. And then of course I'll put the speed gear in it, but quick look at the Stampede 4x4 VXL, the new one that just came out. You guys know I'm a Stampede fiend. They have one more in here at Hobby Town. They got a green and blue one. I think, but of course they can get some more in. So anyway, guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, stay tuned for the next videos. As always, I appreciate you guys watching.